Hello, friends. This is my motto now. Eat to live, don't live to eat, like I used to. And I feel so much better, so much better. I am proud to say that I not only talk the talk, but I walk the walk these five years, over five years. Hello, friends. This is Potato Patty Too Mad. This is my change in address, so anybody that's got the old address, please do not use it. Good morning, friends. July 25. 10 minutes after 11. I just getting over to the house. I woke earlier, but I went back to sleep. Richard uh, mowed. He just mowed down this hill. <laughs> it's a gorgeous day. It's going to be hot though. He mowed just along the side here. And he went over and he mowed across the road. <laughs> that was tall grass. There's a lot of things to mow around. I don't know if he... I don't know if he's going to come back or not. Anyway. Earrings of the day. <laughs> Outfit of the day. <laughs> Selfie stick. <laughs> yeah, I got Richie's backpack on. <laughs> it's easier than carrying everything in my hands. <laughs> it's too hot out. Yeah, to... When I go in, we'll look at the temperature. I'm going to go live in there. What are you doing over there? <laughs> you waiting for mommy over there? Huh? Uh-huh. <laughs> no biting. I'm trying to open the legs on this thing. Nerves of steel, don't you? This one does, yeah. Callie would have run a mile if I put slippers beside her head. Yeah. No biting. <laughs> no biting. I gotta get this backpack off and I got a bag of uh, clean clothes in the porch. There we go. Okay.
I didn't wear sunglasses. That's what was wrong. I didn't wear sunglasses. What am I going to do with herself? My oldest grandson we would always say, throw you in the garbage, Nan. Throw you in the garbage. <laughs> oh. He didn't put the plates away. Okay, she's moved, so... Yeah. I got my phone this time. And then I got ready and went live. There's Callie in the background. There's a little itty bitty dill pickle. And this is when I signed off. Oh, I hear the truck. Did you hear the truck, Callie? Did you hear the truck? Who could this be? Huh? Who is it? It's Dad. You don't have to... Oh, thank you, hon. I forgot that over there. That's so sweet to deliver it to me. After working eight, hard, eight and a half hard hours. Imagine. Picking up a scallop here or a lobster there. Walkie. Walkie? Well, he is on his feet all day doing that. Man's work has never done. <laughs> some of some some jobs over there, there's stools to sit on, chairs to sit on, isn't there? Depending on what you're doing. Yeah. In a lot of places, you gotta have a doctor's note to sit on. Oh, there's your note right beside Missy. Needless to put me orders to run. Yeah, because I had gave him a note before August 22nd, but it's August 3rd. Oh boy, never gonna put that in. There. Well, you'll be getting a checkup. I, there's no point in getting the cleaning if they're going to haul them all, all out. No. That's just a waste of time and energy. And we'll cost money. Yeah. Uh, and I'll be the longest, probably, because I'll have a checkup and cleaning. Yep. I come in at 10 to 11. You go in at 11. So the yours only be 10 minutes? No, hon. There's more than one people at a time because the hygienists do the, do the cleanings and then the dentist just comes in and checks checks things hmm. what's that potato pot is there for it's got uh, s uh sweet potato peelings in it to be dumped into the green card i peeled some potatoes today and uh brought them home in my knapsack i've been using your knapsack Oh, yeah. What's that? Well, it's heavy, but it's, it doesn't have water on it yet. So if you see a bag, a part bag of potatoes missing, that's where they are. There was a part bag over there. Yeah, I peeled them. I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna cook some. Mm -hmm. So there's enough over there for either you to have supper tonight cooked with carrots and turnips and potatoes, or me for my lunch tomorrow. But I did make you a soup for your work tomorrow. Well, I was thinking we were taking a beer stack out and came out right tomorrow. For yeah. supper tonight? Yeah, supper. Mm -hmm. yeah that's all right. Did you already... <laughs> she... <laughs> did you already uh, do the barbecue again with uh, those two pork steaks you bought the other day? Did you cook them and eat them? Yeah. I got two pork chops in there. Yeah. You got... You gotta be a, a metasaurus, hon. I don't know what you're looking for, Josh. What do you think? Well, are they frozen? The, the... Yeah, they frozen. Oh, well, it doesn't really matter then. Mm -hmm. Just cook it all at the same time. Yeah, the next day just go like Save on propane, yeah. Yeah, look at her. See, he's not gonna grab you and put you in the cage. Not until next month. <laughs> All right, I'm getting my supper here, and thanks for bringing my tea over, hon. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, so, yeah. She is still watching you like a hawk. Dad, don't take me, don't take me. <laughs> 
All right, I'm going to get my supper. Yeah, I know. Isn't that sweet? Aww. <laughs> All right. Love you. Thank you. Oh. There's a serving of oat groats, a serving of homemade beans and peas and corn. And it's all starch. I said I was. There's my potatoes. And there's the ingredients in the salt, the Himalayan salt, and the ingredients in the pepper. These are from Walmart. I don't know if they're great value. I forgot to look. There it is, all mingled and married. This is my dessert pickled beets and two plums. Friends, if you could just subscribe and hit the bell and give us a thumbs up, it would help us.